Well, everyone, so we are going to give you a quick tour of Cherry Hill Village, which is in southwest Canton. And uh, Wendy and I live in this subdivision. On our left here is the Village Theater. Wendy, do you want to give everyone a just quick bullet point on the theater here? Theater is a great little theater here in Cher downtown Cherry Hill Village. The, um, the township oh, owns it and there's youth group entertainment centers that come and put on plays. They're actually very entertaining and done very well. Um, and the other thing about it is, is that's where local dance companies come and bring their, their kids to dance and they do a Christmas Spectacular and then a final one in the spring. And then we've got a Cold Stone Creamery and a Blimpy Sub. Uh, there's some other commercial, there's a dog uh, grooming place down the street here, um, a restaurant. Marchino's Pub and then there's the Village Market, which is great. It's been a great addition to Cherry Hill Village. It carries all your little necessities. It's over here on the left, right? Yeah. If you forget something at the grocery store, they've got alcohol, just anything, pop, soda, everything. Village doctor. And then over here on the right, during the summer months, there's a, a fountain that's running and it's, it's, it's quite nice. You can go to the Cold Stone and come out here and sit and eat your ice cream and just enjoy the fountain. And these were the original structures that were built in Cherry Hill Village, which, uh, what, 2001, Wendy, is when? 2001, 2002-ish. Okay, so uh, initially, at that time, there was a, a mix of condos and single family. And so on the right here, you're gonna see some, some condo um, structures. And over to the left, you're going to see some of the larger homes that were built in Cherry Hill Village. On the upper end, mid 500s, Wendy? Yeah, mid 500s. And then on the lower end, there are, there are homes that range in size from 1,100 square feet in Cherry Hill Village all the way up to, what, 5,400 square feet? Mm hmm So a wide range. And tell, tell everyone about the parks. So this subdivision has about three to four parks. Here's one we call it the Gazebo Park, and every year they have a um, movie night or music in the park here. There is a large park, which is straight ahead from us, and that one is the largest in the subdivision, and it houses a great area for playing. It's kind of the midpoint of the subdivision, and it also has a enclosed playscape so that parents can bring their children down and, um, I'm speeding up a little just so we can get to the park. They can slowly. play and it's enclosed so moms can sit and talk or dads and I mean it, it's it's a great subdivision. Sidewalks throughout the whole sub. Great yeah. place to walk your pets, your dogs. Here's the big park Wendy was talking about. And when we moved here how old were our kids Wendy? Uh, two and four. So they came down here all the time and uh, swing sets, slides, now that they're older, they use this park to uh, play football and baseball. And as you can tell, Cherry Hill Village has a uniqueness about it. I mean, look at the homes. They're all different colored, uh, the nice white trim. Some have a smaller front porch, such as this one, or then you look to the next door house here, and it's got a sprawling front porch with swings. Um, it's definitely a subdivision for families, but you don't even have to be a family. We do have lots of uh, retired people in here. Um, I mean, it's just it's just a little slice of America. Hidden. Yeah, and if you uh, pan to the left here, you can see um, from a distance how the homes look. So generally speaking, you've got um, alleyway garages, so you're not going to see many garages from the front, as you can notice here, if you pan to the left. Yeah. And then you can see mainly wood siding homes. There are a few homes with brick, but the architecture basically promoted no garages and facades that uh, have full porches. So a lot of people will um, enjoy outdoor living on their front porches and it kind of promotes uh, you know, friendliness within the community. So 
It's a great sub. Wendy and I have lived here for 10 years now, and uh, it's a great place to raise your kids. It's a great place, uh, like Wendy said, you don't have to have a family because the lots are smaller, so a lot of single um, residents live in here, and it's just, it's, uh, it's a great place to live. Elementary school is very close, and uh, schools, the, uh, high schools within, um, what about 10 minutes, Wendy? High so. school is within about 10 minutes. One more thing I would like to add is there is one section that is still under construction. And the nice thing about the subdivision is, is when you buy in here, the maintenance of the house. I mean, other than, you know, keeping up with some of the trim and the painting of the house, your yards, because of the size lots, is very minimal mm -hmm. to take care of. And a, a lot of people like that because they gives them more time to be outside and socializing. Alrighty, that's our quick tour of Cherry Hill Village. Thank you.